everybody, it's Sally with Vintage Discoveries here with some more vintage jewelry bag and box unboxing and bagging. You know what I mean. So, this is from that auction, that outdoor auction. That was so much fun and a little frustrating. And um, my first time, so I'd never been to one where you hold up a little paddle. Well, it was a paper plate. Good enough. Anyway, when you put together the lots um, and they say, you know, they're going to auction them off, and of course, somebody might else somebody else might um, bid on them. So don't put all your eggs in one basket, which made 100% sense because the largest one that I made had a lot of eggs in it, and uh, I lost that one. So lesson learned. But let's start off with this. I got this from Whatnot. I thought it was pretty. Uh, this was probably initials on there. You can kind of tell what they polished it up said it was sterling so i'm going to double test it because i don't think it's marked but i'm pretty sure it is it's i'm sure because i've bought from the seller before uh harbor one and they've been very good this is one thing that i did put in and i won it's a j king necklace with the box and everything else um but when i took it out when I got home, I noticed that this one is cracked because of the the way the striations or whatever you call those in that. I guess we could glue it somehow, but I was upset about that. I picked up some dice. My son likes to play games and things and I think one of these is Bakelite. So vintage, I thought they were cool. Um, two of the other things that I put was um, a KJL for Avon earrings. That was something that I had put in a box, ho hopefully to win, which I did. And I put them on eBay last night and I sold them this morning. So um, this was the other one that I put in the box. And it's YSL for Avon. That's also on my eBay. So hopefully with those two items, it'll pay for what I paid. And, um, and then the rest is cake or frosting. I don't know what you would call it. But this was pretty too. I like it. It's like ceramic and it has just a pretty winter scene. This is a cute little necklace, right? Just delicate and cute. But yeah, this was the box for the uh, J King. This was the other thing I threw in a box. It was Fabergé. Um, vintage set. what's in there but yeah it's vintage it's older it's not ancient you know it's the earrings are pierced i think the original price was 44 which that's decent can't find anything online so i don't know and you know what this is pretty i like this glass i totally like that <sighs> once brody hears me talking to myself he just needs to go outside hold on one second Okay. Now, like I said, really love the glass pieces on here. And it's so colorful. I don't think it's gold filled. I didn't even check that. Let's see. No, yeah, it looks pretty messed up. Um, this looks like it's from a pendant or an, or an earring. Most likely an earring, I'm going to say. Some of these, which I get a lot of. Oh, something from Ed. Isn't that sweet? 
Might be gold over silver. Or not. I'm surprised if they can write on it like that. Nope, not seeing any indication. I mean, it's made well, but it's definitely personalized. Aww. Um, clamper. Don't think it's marked, but you know how I miss these things. But it's fun for the viewers. Oh. Does that say something? Oh, Monet. <laughs> Monet. Oh. Looks like the toucan, right? A toucan. Not anything specific. Is this I can't tell if it's if it's painted or if that's just cruddy. I think it's just cruddy. celluloid I'm not sure what that is interesting this is pretty and it has the pin I find that happens to me quite often <laughs> lately you know like oh this is so pretty yeah but still thankfully it's fine. That's different. It's missing its little petals here, unfortunately, because I love those colors. Mon Tamagest, 1941. Glad, I guess, to meet you. Montana Highway Department, Yellowstone and Glacier Parks, open the motors. Oh, so maybe it's like a sticker you put on your car. Cute. Yellow metal flower. A little loosey-goosey, that happens. Is it that big? Christmas brooch, just missing one stone. Just, let's say P-E, oh, sorry, B and a J, B and a J, right? That's what I'm saying, that's what I'm saying. Look at that glass, <gasps> it's missing a stone here, it's missing something there. Not sure what was there, but look at these glass pieces. Oh, I love them. Ugh, this. I love that. I guess it's probably Celro. Fishy? before. I should check to see if that's gold. I might destroy the package. Nope. Done soon, I'm making a video. I say soon, but who knows? Yesterday's video was kind of long. 
pretty. Ooh. Big, but it's missing something. Missing one, two, two stones. Didn't get lucky on that one. Oh, I think, yes, this is coral. Does it have anything on the back? No, just a big pad. Daisy Fuentes. I think that's at Coles. Pretty. Don't know what that symbol is. Looks like a crown and a fish. I'll have to look it up. Oh, big blob of glass. On some ribbon. I like the glass. That's the one. Gold butterfly. Haven't had much butterflies lately. I used to get a ton. Some, maybe some. What do you call that? I think it's glass, but it's over glued. Oh, I hate that. It's art. A-R-T, right? Arthur Pepper, I believe. Ooh, you know I love these. What is that? Oh, it's a um, parrot. Right? Some kind of bird. I thought it was Yoda for a second there. A little coin ring. A big apple. Kramer. What's the chances of all the stones being there? Oh, it's a little dirty. We need to check it with the loopy thing just to make sure. But that's awesome. Cute little plastic earring. Almost looks like um, a poppy, which I like. Jerry's. Pretty leaf. Christmas tree, that's nice. It's got some rhinestones down the middle. I like it. Yep, that's Sergio Lub, made in the USA. Some of them are really chunky and heavy and awkward looking, but this is pretty nice and light. This is some plastic. 
Not sure what kind. Interesting. Oh no. I remember when these were popular. I love tops. Tops, okay. Tops. Is it something with that store, maybe? They don't have them in this area, but. stones I think or is it missing the green one I can't tell I've got a whole box of Avon with boxes that I have to go through be doing a video on that. Is this Brighton maybe? What is that in the middle? Looks a little bit but like Brighton but no LC. It's tangled up. This Claiborne, I'm guessing, right? Butterfly. I had the same one another time. It's pretty cool clasp. I like that. Well, this is like the um, almost like the Christmas ornaments. Those the spun. It's missing his clasp, but that spun thread. Pretty close. It's got a lot of wear. Just a gold mall. Gale. Love Dick, nineteen fifty three. It's gold filled plaque. So sweet. They need to bring back that kind of stuff. Romantic, you know what I'm saying? Liberty Bell. Cool. Is it moving or is it me? It's me. Speaking of butterflies, this one's pretty. I like that. Oh. LC again. Pretty enameling. I like it. That's cute. Cloisonne look. Heart. Pretty copper. Oh, that's so sweet. Never had that one. Hope I had the other one. A little sparkly ball. Something pink. More modern earring. Oh, but it is Napier. Like a newer Napier. Love that color. 
Ooh, maybe this belongs to something cool. It's glass. Oh, stretchy ring. This is Monet. That's nice. Nice neutral colors. This is, weighs a ton. Why is it so heavy? Is this glass maybe? I don't know. But this thing is heavy. Heavier than you would think. It is Worthington. I think they make a lot of clothing, like catalog clothes and stuff like that. Right? I don't know if there's an actual store. Initials, it looks like pewter. Oh, here's the other earring. Majorica, something. It belongs to something. Maybe pearls, right? The stretch ring. Stretchy bracelet. Ugh. Cool clip on. Oh, this is pretty. That's chunky. Very pretty. Like it. These are adorable. Usually find these broken though. But that looks like it's pretty good. Okay, get out of there. This is an oldie. Very worn, but it's very old, so it's to be expected. This is interesting glass. Let's see if it's sterling. I've never seen that before. I thought maybe it was sterling glass, but I don't see any mark on it. Weird, right? And they have kind of an AB shine to them. This had something in it, perhaps a picture. Looks gold filled. Yeah. Catamore. Gold filled. Or maybe it had a stone in it. Pretty. I love this Lucite stuff. Love it. Peacock, 15 bucks. Can you let Brody in? See you. Can you let Brody in? Anybody there? Another one of these. Sparkly. Okay. Isabel, can you let Brody in? Thank you so much. See, look, broke, broken. That's cute. Sorry for the close up. Listener. It's plastic, I guess. Uh, faux. 
tortoise shell. Is that something? No, I guess it's just a design. Maybe it's just me thinking it's something. Here's the other listener. These are really worn. Another one of these cute ones. Stretchy. Let's see. A guy on a horse. Looks like a pewter. I can't read that. The, uh, the Partina or something like that. I'll have to get the thing out. But in, is his sword broken? Is it, should have there should there have been a sword? Doesn't look like it, but I don't know. More research needed. Another one of these. I think it's for like a pocket watch. Some painted metal earrings. Earring. Trying to get to the bottom. It's quite a bit of tangles. Is this? Stretch bracelet. Matching. Another one that matches that one. It's pretty. This little guy. And this. A little stretchy. The hearts are nice on that. That's a stretchy bracelet I already looked at. This is a snowflake, but it's caught up in this red glass bead necklace. Uh, I think this is a pendant brooch, yep. It says something on it. Does it say Coro? I do believe so. Alright. Lots of red beads. Has a nice matching clasp. These are pretty. Or oh, this. I don't think they're sterling, but they are cute. Some old clip-ons. I love that color. That's my color. Cruddy earring. There's a big Big tangles coming. I don't know why it's all attached to each other. Um, a silver toned necklace. I don't think it's gold. Um, I don't think it's silver. It's not tarnished enough. But we can always look 
glass was messed up. Now, what? It's not bad. I guess you can use that like a connector. Okay. sure what that is. Does it look familiar? I don't know what that is. I'll lay it out. Like a Y necklace with some hearts. It's cute. Um, heart that's pretty a chain it's a stretchy attached to this necklace with pink and gray I'm trying to see if there's a clasp on it seeing anything. plastic. One of these. Another one of these earrings. I'm special. This looks promising. because you never know. It's pretty though. I like the brush. Brush to gold. Something is preventing me. Any silver? No. wanted to grab everything so that was the problem it's cute and dainty this again another one of these these good because I think these are pretty
0.925. I guess it's just gold over silver. Don't look at me. So it's pretty. One of these. These glass beads, though. Oh, it's nice. Appreciate those glass beads. Religious pendant. Still trying to get this out of the. Or untangle it right now, but that's pretty. Little pearl dangle and that. So there's a big a big mess that I need to untangle. It's probably this oh those are the worst. The ones with the ball that you just adjust that don't basically open at all. Totally aggravating. But, got that. And, a whole big mess too. This is adorable. And it's celebrity. Very 70s. I like it. Of course, that looks to be about it. A few broken things and this little random scraps oh, this goes with the necklace but there's only one oh, okay oh and there's this bag i took out of there oh, i'm gonna dump this my videos are running so long this Oh, here's the other coral earring. Then you have this. This. This clatter. It's that. I've had this before. Uh, Solador, I think it's called. Pronounced. That's pretty. Some cufflinks. Those are heavy. Oh, pretty stone heart in. <sighs> It'll come back to me. Why do they do it like that? Shouldn't it be the other way? Weird. Okay. Um. A clown. Oh, it's not JJ. It's two sisters. Two sisters. I don't think I've ever had that. Big shoe clip. That's that moosey, musy. I've had that before. But I don't see the other one. Pendant. More St. Patrick's Day. S. Is it SFJ? And it's numbered. Hmm. 
I'm surprised. The other earring. Oh, these are um, cufflinks. I like those. Let's see. Pretty. Avon. Nina Richie with an R. I like these. Enamel earrings. The design is cool, so I like that. These earrings, I'm sure my teacher wore. Oh, here's that other earring. Little CZ. Monet. Big clip on. I don't know how people do it. It's lightweight though, so it's not bad. This little bracelet. This is nice. I guess I'm really liking the brush gold lately. No markings. It's it's kind of worn. These little cute earrings. Well, there's only one. One of these. I'm guessing this is supposed to look like jade, right? This is some kind of stone or glass. You can use those for crafting. We have these and this. That's pretty. Looks like NTH, maybe Thailand, because it's not, doesn't seem old. Sure has a lot of sparkle on it though. I don't know. No lobster claw. Does that say something or is it me? No, I don't see any 925 mark. That's pretty. Uh, I think I saw that one already, right? Somebody's ring. 1995. Canaries. Oh, there's a name in there. Okay. Well, that'll do it. Definitely ran long again. Thanks for joining me, guys. I'll be back really soon with more unboxing and also that forever taking me forever sale. But I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to uh, subscribe, like, and share if you can. And let me know what you think. See you later. Thanks. Bye.